Cats facing charges tonight for getting into a fight with a boy a third of his age. He was caught on camera pinning the boy down at a playground. Ralph Iannotti went to the guy's house this evening and joins us live now with more. Ralph. Much, Kim. Uh, tonight, a Pittsburgh man is facing criminal charges after that incident in a playground right near his home. He allegedly got into a confrontation with a 13 year old boy and literally took matters into his own hands. I'm 13, sir. I'm 13. He's on top of me. He's a grown man. In this video, you see 46 year old Thomas Dandria of Greenfield pinning the teenage boy. The confrontation took place last week in a playground across the street from Dandria's Saline Street home. The cell phone video was taken by the boy's sister, who pleads for Dandrea to let her brother go. She said he has asthma. Can you please get off my I brother? Can't. You can't. I'll call I him. Can't. I can't until the can't. police get here. Dandrea told police he saw the boy in this construction truck parked nearby. The truck was not Dandrea's. According to the juvenile, he walked over to the abandoned truck to check it out and to sit inside. Dandrea told the boy he was calling police he would give him a head start to run. The boy admitted he swung at the man, hitting him in self-defense after he dodged a punch thrown by the older man. His mouth is bleeding. He has asthma. Can you please get off I my don't brother? Give a f he just assaulted me. A criminal complaint states that Dandrea witnessed a young man vandalizing the truck. He called police multiple times and nothing happened. So he decided to confront the juvenile himself. He added that he took it upon himself to pin the boy down until police arrived. After sorting through details, police said we determined Dandria to be the aggressor, and they advised Dandria not to go back to the playground for any reason. Dandria is charged with criminal mischief and uh, uh, assault, simple assault. Uh, he'll be sent a summons in the mail. Uh, we went to his house tonight, but no one answered the door. We're live tonight outside City Court. I'm Ralph Iannotti, KDKA News.